Um, we played, everybody, we had some guys really step up and play really well. Um, we had the game one down the stretch. We just didn't get stops when we needed to. And then the two second out of bounds play, we just turned the ball over and let him get a two point shot. But it's tough to swallow, man. We got our guys played great. You know, the crowd showed up. I mean, it was a great game for us. You think you got the shot off? I didn't see it, honestly. What's it like waiting in that huddle for them to, to make the decision? I mean, Coach was trying to get us to stay focused, you know. I think I think he kind of knew that the guy got it off in time. So he was just saying, you know, get ready for overtime. So keep your heads up. You know, we said come out here and play. How much do you think that affected y'all? I mean, it was definitely a blow to us. You know, I think I do feel like some guys kind of really just checked out. It felt like we already had the game won. So when we came out in overtime, we didn't have really any energy anymore. Yeah. You come that close to a three for three homestand to finish this thing out. I mean, can you still use it? To have some momentum going into next Thursday? I mean, there were definitely a lot of positives out of this game in the past two games. We just got to keep our heads up. You know, it's a tough loss, but we had an opportunity to do something great next week in the ACC tournament. Given how the first game against those guys went, I mean, is it a sign of progress how, how well you played them this time? Yeah, I mean, I think home court advantage has a lot to do with that, though. You know, a lot of teams are losing uh, on the road and winning at home against teams they play twice. So we just got to keep our heads up, you know. Ever been a part of anything like this? Uh, not really. That's <laughs> nah, really crazy. How do you, uh, how do you sort of shake it off and, and turn the focus to the postseason now? Um, I mean, we just got to refocus. You know, we got to shake this one off and get ready. You know, we got to come in tomorrow, probably watch some film and get some shots. So we just got to put this one behind us. It's how hard was? I'm sorry. How hard is it to fo- How hard was it to focus going into that overtime after the way that? that whole regulation ended? I mean, some guys were definitely angry. You know, we, we had the game one. We just got, and we're smarter than that, you know. But we just had to try to stay focused. I don't think guys, for the most part, had focus coming in overtime. They started off and, and were up by four um, pretty early there, and Coach Brownell called a timeout, and you all sort of went on the run to take control of the game. Uh, you remember what he said in that timeout? Which one was it, overtime? No, in the first half when they were ahead, and then you all came back and – uh, he was just telling us to keep pushing, you know. I mean, basketball is a game of runs, so we were on a run, so he wanted us to keep pushing. You know, we had some guys come off the bench and give us some energy. And then once they gave us energy, you know, guys, the starters came back in and, and kept it flowing. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, Sean. Appreciate it, man.